There's 97 right out of the gate. Dalton. But Kyle Wright has not gotten a lot of support from his offense. Varsho slams one out to right field. Duvall is there. Yeah. And that's allowed out number one. Josh walked and scored a run in the opener on Monday. D-backs at one point trailed six to two, came back to win it eight to seven. In ten innings, they got two in the bottom. It really was. A lot of fun. Here's the changeup from and they did it against the Braves, really their best relievers back there. I mean, that's a tough group. They brought in Minter, the lefty. They saw Colin McHugh, Will Smith, another lefty, of course, Kenley Jansen. So uh, Nice job by the Diamondbacks against. Well, Kyle Wright has been among their most effective starters over the first. And has really fallen in love with that curveball. This is lifted out to left field. Guillermo Heredia. And that's out number two. Oh. You've never seen a snake with a party hat on? Oh, well, that was the one time. <laughs> You tell the 260 couple of home runs had a single in the ninth inning that extended his hitting streak. And with 13 games, that's a career high, but he's behind at the count here. Owen. Here's that curve. Look out. Belted back up the middle to make it 14 consecutive games for Cattell Marte. Well, got the fast. 96 up is ball one. So walk. He's got the four. Breaking ball missed in. Two and two. Two two. Got him. There's that curveball. We played one off the Diamondback second against right hander Kyle Wright, who now has a two nothing lead. David up to 245, single twice, drove in a pair of runs in last night's comeback win. A lot of change ups from. That's out of play. It was a big uh, win last. Delivered McCarthy to tie it up, and then Peralta was the winning run in that ball game. Yeah, if Ozzie Albies was too on his jump, the ball got there so quickly. Short people got no reason. <laughs> I triple in the ninth Sunday against the Dodgers. So he has risen to the occasion, and that one misses up in the zone for a leadoff walk. Gonzo will be making the trip with us out yeah. to. Uh, the Midwest. Tom Candiotti is taking some vacation time. So Gonza will be on the radio side as we go to Pittsburgh, Cincinnati, and Philadelphia. It all opens up at PNC. He has a great gift. I've always said no one's better at being Gonzo than Gonzo. He's the expert. He is perfect. Deep fly ball for a run in the sixth inning last night. And a tough at bat against a good lefty, A.J. Minter. It's going to Ooh. High strike call there. The fastball at 96. And that looks. This is bounced to second. Ozzie Albies will go to second. They get the force on David. Here we talked about the first pitch of the at bats in the ball. That sinker is low. They will concede the. Well, buckled him with that curve and got the high strike call again. Swanson, that short stop. They go the short way, and that's the end of the second inning. It and I think when you look back at the Jose Herrera, everyone seems impressed by that move by the rookie. That's out of play at 2 and 2. Of course, Gallant. It's like he's been back there 15 years. 
That was a veteran move. Yeah, it was a veteran move, and I'm sure he had to do that him go out there to the mound. Torrey very quickly joined the argument. Trying to create that distraction. There's the right curveball. Dalton had a very Dalton Varsho type game last night. He only had one hit. But he was on base all night. He was hit by a pitch. He walked. He singled. He's game tying run with a long fly ball in the ninth inning. Kind of a virtuoso performance. Run is on base three other times. That's what you expect from a leadoff hitter. Get on base, set the table for the guys behind you, and occasionally hit one out of the ball. With Josh Rojas on deck. A couple of weeks after that. Over the mound, and Swanson is there near the bag at second. And that's two outs. Funny thing is, as good as Wright has been this year, it's been a struggle to get each of the first 10 games in which he pitched, going back to the previous year. It's been most of 2019 in triple by the Dodgers in a start in the NLCS. Did not survive the first. One more time for Swanson. Charge is going to have to hurry. Bare hand play. Throws it into the stands. Rojas. And extended his hitting streak. He's now hits. The Diamondbacks have had a number of big two out. Zoom ball that time on a fastball at 96. Taking all the way, looks at ball four. This is in with a fastball. That's that sinker. Walker has hit home runs in seven of his last 50. Christian Walker in the first inning last. There's a chance for Jim Tolar. The toll booth. Ooh, good take right there. Couldn't get him to bite on that curveball. And it's two. Up and in with a sinker. That's a strike. And here's right to start the fourth. Peralta sends one toward the gap. And Duval won't get there. It's off the wall. Freight train on the tracks. He's headed for second. He'll stop there. It's a double for David. Well, he's really heating up. He really. Aben jumps on the first pitch sinker. Aben caught looking at a border. Right through the wickets, they go to third, and David is out of there. Curveball is a strike. Alec. All right, he's throwing that change up a fair amount. Uses it to. Diamondbacks open up this homestand by taking both games from Kansas City. Then, of course, they were swept in four by the Dodgers and looking to close. Changeup is in there for a strike. That's five strikeouts for Kyle Wright and two outs in the fourth. A reminder, fans, what you need is at dbacks.com slash kids club. Jake Hager looks at a strike. Whoops. Lost the handle on a sinker and Pavin moves up. It gets behind. Just tied him up in knots. He's had a lot of faith in that change up today. Jake Hager was. He was. 
Well, he almost threw another one back there. Full count three and two. Jose Herrera would be. And Hager works a walk. Change up sailed again on Kyle Wright. Starting to lose a feel for that pitch. <laughs> He's trying to throw it to the backstop. Don't look happy. 1 1. And when all else fails, go back to your most used pitch, the one he has. The Rockies. 1 2 on Herrera. Albee scoops that up at second. And Kyle Wright survives after four. Our show, the DH is 0 for 2. And there is that curveball. That's his number one pitch. Feel like you've had good at bats, but that third time through, there should be no surprises. Well, Kyle Wright has been pitching pretty to the Phillies. Braves got him only one run in that ball game. Did not go, says Jim Reynolds, the crew chief down at third. This is skied out to short right. Albies calling everybody off. And there's one away. Another no hitter alert, partner. Another one. Justin Verlander. He's okay. Coming off Tommy John surgery, Justin Verlander. Change ups the strike, and it's one and one. Yeah, Verlander already has three no hitters in his career. Good documentary out there. I don't know if you've caught this. It's called Facing Nolan. It's about to it. Oh, he was special. That's floating around out there. You can check it out. Of course, uh, you know, all the legends about him throwing 180 pitches in a start, then riding an exercise. First things uh, we were told as rookies facing Nolan Ryan. Hey, kid, if you happen to get lucky enough to hit one off of Nolan, don't. And we saw a lot of that in the fourth inning. Wright missing wildly with some of his pitches. Not just change up, that was a fact. And they missed with a curve now, too, and that's number one, so. Got the 2 0 fastball and missed it. And heavy. Yeah, he's on the ropes here. Three and one. Nice. And he's walked four again today behind on Marte. Three and one. And hold on there. That's a strike, says Alex. Back to back walks. He has walked a season high. We've had good luck working Christian in with sinkers. But Curveball is in there. And he jumps ahead 0 2. 0 2 to Christian Walker. Again, the sinker in. On the ground to third. Riley scoops it up. Albies turns it. And that's the killer walk. Right in the fourth and 21 in the fifth. This is slicing out to Heredia in left field and he's got it to shy of the warning track. Hit hard, but right at Ozzie Olbies. Two outs in the sixth. 
No surprise for Albies right there. Once again today, even though neither team took batting practice on the field, Albies was out here with Ron Washington going through there. Leads Swanson midway between second and third. And on the line at first. Curveballs the strike one and one. Into the bullpen, Colin McHugh with Kyle Wright at 100 pitches. And Swanson, the only guy over there, makes the backhand play, and Wright works a one, two, three. <laughs>